Jesus said that his church would be a costly bride. And as always, his prophecy is true. Her price has proven to be unspeakable terror and rivers of blood. It began with Stephen. When Paul, not yet one of us, had him stoned in the streets of Jerusalem. My brother James was next, beheaded for preaching the risen Christ in the temple. Matthias, tied to a cross, draped with carrion, eaten by vultures. Jude Thaddeus, crucified and shot to death with arrows. Oh, Nathaniel was skinned alive and crucified in double agony. Philip was hanged from the column of a Greek temple. Andrew crucified in Egypt. Matthew beheaded in Alexandria. Mark dragged to death behind a chariot. James Alpheus thrown from Herod's temple roof. Thomas speared by a mob. Simon the Zealot sawed to pieces alive. Peter and Paul were taken in Rome, while thousands of believers gorged Nero's lions in the Colosseum. Paul beheaded on the Appian Way. Peter was forced to watch his beloved wife crucified on Vatican Hill, and all through her agony, he cried out to her, O oh, thou beloved, remember Christ! Remember Christ! Peter felt unworthy to die, as Jesus said. So he asked to be and was crucified, head downward. Beloved, if someone comes to you and says, I will believe your gospel if you can give me one proof, tell them. Tell them of these ordinary men who overturned the world and proclaimed to the very end, some from their own crosses, the life-giving truth of the triumphant risen Christ!